Hey, what's up y'all? It's Don and today we are finally fixing the crappy audio that you guys have been hearing on my Quest videos lately. That's right. So I can't thank Antlion Audio enough for sending me a wireless mod mic, man. It, I tested this last night and it is absolutely amazing quality and I cannot wait to show you guys the difference it makes in my videos going forward. So thank you, thank you, thank you for sending this my way. I am going to totally use this every video from now on. So. You guys know for the longest time I have been wanting to put out a proper video for Shadow Point because A, I love Coat Sync games, and B, I, it's got Patrick Stewart doing the frickin' narration, and well, it's Patrick Stewart. So anyway, I'm gonna test out the wireless mod mic with Shadow Point, and hopefully we are finally gonna get a true and proper video. So, all right, let's get this thing popped on the side of the quest. Let's get in there, and let's check out Shadow Point. All right, here we are in Shadow Point, guys. Finally, finally, you can hear the game's audio and you can hear my voice. Uh, so, you know, once again, thanks again, Antlion Audio. This has definitely stepped up my game, and I, I, I can't thank you guys enough for that. So, all right, since we're in here, let's let's uh, go ahead and uh, finally take a look at the game. Now, you know, I've played this a couple of times now um, on camera, and both times were disasters. So uh, we're, 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 we're definitely <laughs> hoping that that doesn't happen again today. Now, because I am doing a green screen video, I am not going to walk around as much because uh, I've got to kind of stay in the confines of my small green screen but uh, you know rest assured you can actually do some room scale in this game with the quest and it works phenomenally so all right let's get started um, let's see here so we are at the cable car station looks like we've got to get up to shadow point observatory what do we have Lorna here? McCabe vanished on June 25th 1996 the day the tremors began I assumed she fell into the ravine and the mountain would collapse and bury her. During my month at the summit, I discovered two things. Shadow Point Observatory doesn't merely view the heavens, and Lorna McCabe is still alive. Oh, man, that's good. I am so happy to hear that she is still alive because, you know, she, she seems like she's a pretty cool chick. You know, I wouldn't want anything bad to happen to her, but... All right, so let's see here. Alex Burkett, student. I'm assuming that is me. And uh-oh, I got an eviction notice. What's going on, man? We might like forget to pay the rent, Captain. So, all right, let's get out here and explore a bit. Thank you. Please come again. Oh, hey, there's somebody back there. Hello. Quiet, they assert you screamed on the mountain. They said you knew. The girl I can out. hear you. What do you believe? Was it a monster or a curse or aliens? It was a tragedy. Aliens? Make sure it never happens again. Never been this tested. stuff? It's a... no. Now, I don't know if you guys saw that on camera, but when you, when you actually go out of your bounds, uh, in some instances in this game, I've noticed instead of turning on the camera, it actually just uh, makes the scene black. So maybe that's because I intersected with the geometry. I don't know. Um, but be forewarned, it is uncomfortable when that happens. So, all right. Let's go call the camera. It's sight. It's running. Ah. Alex Burkett, open the door. Your parents uh, are yeah, that's me. their minds. Oh, hey, Dad. Um, well, uh, I'm sorry, man. It's it's time to let this bird fly, okay? Um, I'm going to get on this cable car, and I'm going to go up there. Uh, so, um, obviously, I locked you guys out for a reason. I don't know. All right. And there we have it. No, Alex. Stay right where you are. Do not move. It's moving. No, Alex, uh, no, I'm moving. You know what's um, you okay, know um, what's I'll be back later, there. guys. Uh, I'm gonna um, take this cable car up here now. Um, so thank you. Um, uh, I much, I very much appreciate everything you've done and, and will do in the future as my General parents. Of Edgar uh, but right now, July I'm gonna be 1996. 
Last month, 32 students visited Shadow Point Observatory. There was an earthquake, then a head count. A 12-year-old girl was missing, Lorna McCabe. The police combed the mountain and the town swept the valley. No satchel, no body, no trace. When the second tremor hit, they abandoned the search. But the town needed answers. So did her family. Edinburgh Geotech ordered a survey for someone to spend a week alone at the edge of the world. They wanted measurements, good press, and an explanation. I never told them what I found. Man, I gotta say, I, I love hearing Sir Pat's voice. I, you guys know I'm a huge Trek nerd, and I mean, obviously, yes, is not the card, you know, but it's just, he, the man has such a soothing voice, and well, damn, all right, the day has turned to night. For eons, mankind has sought wisdom among the stars. We look to the constellations to navigate. Shooting star. Nice. I've made it to Shadow Point. And man, I gotta tell you, you know, yes, the quest, the, the graphics are dumbed down in certain games, but this one, the art style plays really, really nice in the screens of the quest. It just, everything just looks good. So, all right, let's go ahead and get on with it. We have now made it to Shadow Point Observatory. The initial seismogram only raised more questions. Gravity shifted between rooms, drawn to some intangible point. Behind every door, another spatial fragment. I examined the lobby using a waveform generator. With the right frequency, the fragment could be agitated. Oh, that's the one that Jordy made. Sweet. Torn open. Okay, so not much in the game is interactive other than the things that are interactive. Um, I've noticed that. So you definitely can't go picking up everything that you see. Uh, which eh, sometimes is a good thing, sometimes is a bad thing. Um, definitely makes it more believable when you can actually interact with more objects. Alright, let's see here. Oops. Let's turn that on and punch the key. Yes! Through the impossible window, I heard birds, the rustle of leaves. Then a voice, Whoa. and for the first time I knew Very cool. she was alive, and she was waiting. Very cool. Okay, we have stepped through the wall into the meat and potatoes of what this game is actually about. So, obviously, Shadow Point, Shadow Puzzles, uh, you know, most of the time in the game is going to be spent uh, aligning things to fill in silhouettes and boom there the shadows are reminded the door. of who she used to be in the games she played with her sister they're both a barrier and a beacon memories guiding the way okay so now interestingly enough you can just completely block the light with what would be your virtual head or your virtual body so that that definitely is a little bit immersion breaking but we'll give them a pass on that because sometimes the the puzzles get a little complex down the road and you really would have to be directly in front to make it work so just saying whoa hey bird Someone's here in the garden. Oh uh, yeah, I'm in the garden. There we go. I can't see 
down there. It's too dark. Oh, these stupid drapes. I know I'm in charge. You should hide or tidy yourself up. Got it. I'll wait. We'll both wait. It'll be fine. And there we go. I like how the, the controller gives you a little haptic feedback as you get closer to locking into the position. Um, it's a nice use of that. Uh-huh. There we go. There we go. And boom. Got the moon. There, no. Nice. Oh, hey, there's that cool bird. Halt! You stand before Lorna, sovereign queen of all Illyria. And you? Well, oh, hey, Lorna. Wait. Uh, I'm, I'm Don, or, or like, Come as most people know here. me, VR Gamer Dude. Um, oh, okay. I, I, I'll come over there. Alex! Alex! Oh. Um, ignore this. I'm the queen. Surprise! I figured since no one well, else sure was around. Where did you go? I looked for days. Oh, you know, well, um, like, you know, recently I just kind of got back from Pennsylvania. Last time um, for, you know, screaming in your face. Forget it. You shouldn't have done You hungry? I'll get some fruit. Always hungry. Oh, cool. Hey, could you give me like a Don't banana leave again. and maybe some okay. like uh, stay some right there. melon? Stay right there. Uh, okay, um, I'm gonna stay right here. This um, is amazing. You could, you could be the royal vizier. Well, I, yeah, I mean, I'm I considered. I got a pretty good gig right now, but you know, if it had had like really good pay with benefits, you know, that 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 might sway me. So, all right, I think, you know what, guys, in the, in the spirit of not making these videos extremely long, I, I think we are going to go ahead and cap this one here. This seems like a, a, good, a good a place as any to stop. But, you know, uh, I'll tell you what, man, the Antlion Mod Mic Wireless has completely changed the game for me. I'm going to be using it on all of my videos going forward. Um, and, and, you know, obviously, Coat Sync, you guys have just once again delivered an absolute masterpiece with Shadow Point here. So I am going to leave a, a link for both the, the uh, Mod Mic Wireless and for Shadow Point in the description if you wanted to grab one of those for yourself or grab this game for yourself then head to the links and uh, make it happen but for me guys thank you so much for watching to the end of the video you guys know i love it when you do that it means the world to me um so you know, leave me a comment down there let me let me know how you think the uh the mod mic wireless sounds on this video uh but for me i'm out this is don vr gamer dude signing off y'all